write out what you're like one word that you're trying to get across to your audience. Don't, you don't have to say the word, but just make sure you have that one word like inspiration or motivation or strictly business or what that one word is and then picture the audience listening to you. I first started doing this I was like oh my gosh it sounds like you know tr you're trying to sell something like trying to sell a car to someone that wants a new car or you're trying to you know sell a new table to someone that's looking at furniture um, so with this we don't have a specific store that you know people come into we don't have a furniture we're not we're like a furniture store but not really we're like a car dealership but not really we have something that you know people don't People don't get on Facebook to find a new business um, to start. That was what my mind started thinking around was, you know, people that are in sales, they have, you know, that, oh, I'm going to, you know, Google where to find a water filter. <laughs> people know exactly where to go to get what they're wanting. So we're a little bit different because we're online and we're, you know, popping up when people don't expect it. So make sure that you have that word written out that you're trying to get across to your audience. You're showing them exactly what they want to see. That's really what ads are, is us showing our audience exactly what they need. So um, picture the actual audience you're trying to talk to. And if you haven't done the avatar challenge, I had such a, I don't know why I had such a hard time making an avatar for myself, but when I finally figured out, you know, who I was trying to talk to, um, it made it really, it made it really, really easy to actually talk to them. So picture who you're trying to talk to and in your ad, have one word that you're trying to get across to them without actually saying it. So like, hey, come here, I've got what you need, but <laughs> put that out there with what you're saying that isn't exactly that word. Another thing is do something random to catch their eye. Um, we were in, when we were in, um, dang it, where were we? We were in Malibu last week and we walked past these people that were dressed like they were in the 50s. And I was like, that is so awesome, but why in the world are they dressed like that? And I looked at them probably like six or seven times while we were on their little pier. And I kept like, what are they doing? And so then I thought back to my red dress ad. Do something that stands out and actually catches people's eye. Something that's going to make people, you know, be like, wow, if you want to dress up like you're in the 50s and then have something like, you know, my favorite movie is Grease. <laughs> you know, something that's going to be, you know, catchy, um, but it's also going to be relatable to, um, you know, your audience. So <laughs> the very last thing this actually happened when we were just outside. This was just an idea. Like my child is eating dog food. I started eating dog food and I was like, ah. Uh, is, is that even normal? Is that even safe? And I was like, dang, that'd be such a good headline. As I was trying to get dog food out of her mouth. So <laughs> having something like that as a headline to draw people into your, your ad um, video or ad, whatever it is, something like that, that people are like, oh my God, my dog, my daughter just tried to eat dog food too. Yeah, that was something that I thought was funny. I would totally click on something if I saw that because that's, my two-year-old was literally eating dog food um so that was just something a little bit different my daughter has eaten dog food also so I'm sure I would have had other moms click on that like what the heck or people that don't have kids that are like oh my gosh this this lady's feeding her dog her child dog food so um yeah, just do something that stands out, something that's going to catch your eye. I seriously was scrolling through my page earlier, and I felt like everything was so repetitive. Um, so I was like, I'm just going to start doing something that kind of pops a little more. So I'm about to make an ad about my daughter eating dog food. And then, yeah, just go from there.